to our part two of our Disney haul, Disney and Universal haul. Um, you'll have to bear with me because we lost the footage for part two and we've had to, so we've got to do it again. Um, so some of the things I've done I might do again because I can't remember what was on the second haul. So um, bear with me. I'll do the second haul, and if you've seen it before, well, yeah, you've seen it before. Um, Bethan's here as well, so she'll be helping. So if anything goes wrong, it's all Bethan's fault. Oh, no, you blame the person who's not here. <laughs> so, um, so here we go. Right, we'll start off with the chocolate. Well, we were on a dining plan, and just like everybody else, we had loads of snack credits and, and quick service credits left. Uh, so we went into the Ghirardelli, I think we had something ridiculous like $600 worth of, of you know, points, credits, whatever, to spend in there. And um, we still didn't spend more, but we had a good go. So, we've got these bags, these bags are gorgeous. And they're actually freezer bags to keep everything to keep everything cool. So we got a couple of these, and I'll be emptying the chocolate out of them. We got plenty of chocolate. Looks like somebody's already had one. Because there should have been two each. So that's what we got. And Kian got dark chocolate because he loves dark chocolate. There we go. And oh no, it's here. Found it. So that's the other raspberry. Um, it was sea salt and caramel and raspberry. And uh, oh right, yeah. We had a couple of bags of these, peppermint bark. I haven't actually tried this, apparently it's supposed oh, to be... Oh, it's really good. <laughs> really, really nice. Um, and it's just coming in now with it heading up to Christmas. So, I'll be tasting these. And... And we've got the mixed bag, so that's got everything in it. It's got oh fudge caramel. That's a new one to me. Chocolate caramel, dark chocolate, sea salt caramel, raspberry, There's a normal mint, milk chocolate as well. Um, milk chocolate. So we've got all sorts there. There we go. Mm. So don't worry, not we're not eating all of this. We have been on a diet for the holiday and we did really well and lost quite a bit of weight. And we don't want to bang all that weight back on again. So this will be for presents for friends and family and what have you. Uh, and I'll just show you what's in the other one because, like I said, we've had two bags. If you don't want any of it, give it to James and Ethan, they'll have you. <laughs> so, oh, these. They're really good. Give a deli, I've done a peppermint bark snowman. Okay. It's like milk chocolate on one side and white chocolate on the front with the... Um, little peppermint bits in, they're quite nice. Oh, I don't know because I've not tried <laughs> these yet. Um, and I thought I could do something nice with them, like um, popping them on the um, Christmas tree or something for the kids. Mm. So, um, yeah, I was I really 
really pleased with those. Um, I think I've got about 10. Um, there's two in a pack as well, Mum. Is there? Yeah, I thought there was two, only one. They're two little ones. Oh. They're about that big, about an inch. Oh, well, I, was, I, I didn't know about that. <laughs> so you got double the amount. Mm. Kim got a chocolate bar, which got crushed. Um, a caramel one. It's like double the size of the little ones that you get when you go in. Your little freebies. <laughs> ah, right. Here's some more. We've got peppermint bark. Three packs. These are for Kip. Be one of these. And three bars of dark chocolate peppermint bark. And like I say, we've never tasted these before and they're supposed to be really nice, so I might have a little bit of them. But I can see them taking ages because we're on a diet, so it's just a little treat every now and then. Um, some more bits that Kian got. He picked up hot cocoa mix peppermint. So, that's those. I don't know how many you picked up, you picked up quite a few. Peppermint's going to be on the Christmas stuff, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and... Ah, oh, right, Kian's again. He picked up six bars of Hazelnut Heaven. And the reason there's so many bars of everything is because it was buy two, get one free. Um, so that's why things seem to be in like threes, sixes and what have you, so there we go. And in here are just more bags of caramel and snowmen. So um, we went to um, uh, Goofy's candy store. So we got a few other bits. So we got strawberry truffle. Looking forward to tasting that. And waffle cone caramel. We never tasted that one either. So that's those. If I remember, you did get the uh, strawberry truffle last year. Did we? Yeah, you got one bar. You gave it to me and James and Ethan at it. Oh, it's per normal. normal. But he, he didn't mind it. So we picked up so as well right. some little tins of peppermint. These I like these for, for in the car. And looking at them, it looks like they're, they're not just plain. They are actually little characters. So there we go. Um, I think that's all. The, uh, the chocolate and things. There might so, be some more sweets. Yeah, there might be some more sweets somewhere, I'm not too sure. So, we went to Universal and we've been dying to get this from last year because we, we forgot to go back. We saw them and we said, oh, we'll have one of those. We'll get it when we come back. And we forgot to go back and pick one up. So it's actually a Florida license plate. So it's um, obviously got these dealies because it was done in Universal and they weren't allowed to do Disney because of the copyright. So it's Dis dealies. And um, yeah, we were quite happy with that. So that'll be going up in the office. One day when we was on the transport, we was chatting to the bus driver and um, he was swapping over with another bus driver. And so we were chatting away to him and as he left, he turned around and gave us a little, a little uh, present. Now we've never seen these before, but they're like a little poker chip really, made in, out of wood and it's got Disney transport on the other side. 
and we got one each. So we got three. So they were. I've never, know, I've never seen them before. So if anybody has, um, let us know down in the the comments section. But yeah, that was quite a nice little little treat. So they'll be going up in the office. Right. We also went to obviously the Star Wars land opened while we were there, and we got a. A pass into Ogre's Cantina and we asked if there was anywhere we could get the um, menu so that we could have a menu ourselves and they said no they didn't do them but the menu that we did have was a bit battered and, and what have you so the, so the server we had actually turned around to us and said look you can have this one don't worry about it so we actually got a menu from Ogre's Canteen. So here we go. And we also got the um, the mats that you put your drinks on. And we got three of those as well because there was three of us. So there we go. That was quite nice. <clears throat> and while we was in Star Wars land, Kian spotted this and he liked it and he decided to go back for it um, later on and it's a, a what is it, Dijaric board, board game and it's the game they were playing on the Millennium Falcon um, when uh, when they were practicing, I don't know, fighting or what have you. Since they don't ask me which one it is, I don't know. So there we go. It's really heavy, actually. Yeah. Um, it's, um, so the there. other side is yeah. The, the other side, board. the other side is a checkers board. So if they can't figure out how to play one, they can flip it over and play checkers. But he'll be taking that to his friends to play with him so um, sure. he'll be glad that we have eventually got this um, haul done because he's been waiting to take it back take it up to his friends so they can have a go <coughs> right we went obviously to Walmart and Ian as per usual went for his lucky charms and brought back a huge Bag. I just noticed it's a new sealable bag. <laughs> yeah, it's a new sealable <laughs> bag, and um, it's a 23 ounce bag it is. So it's, I'm sure it was bigger last year when he brought them. Back. No, I but think anyway, they're the lucky charms that he had brought back. I, eat, I can't say for his breakfast because he eats them any time of day. Usually, <coughs> sorry, he usually eats them at night when he comes in. So, do you think if I had some nervous? <laughs> <laughs> right, and this we got from one of the malls actually, and it's the Demigorgon. There we go. And if you open the back of it, smaller one comes out and if you open that oh the baby comes out so it's like the three stages of how the demigorgon grew and stranger things I thought that was really good and if he didn't buy it I was gonna buy it <laughs> but there was only a couple of those left like I say, it was just on one of the stalls that you get in the um, in the malls. It wasn't a shop itself. You could probably buy it out one of the you know one of the shops or what have you. But um, but yeah, he got it out of, off one of the stalls. And we went to uh, the malls. We actually went to um, <coughs> Converse store. 
and um, they had offers on and what have you and one of the offers was buy one get the second half price um, and these were already dropped in price anyway so Kian found these ones and they were dropped from $60 to $50 to start with and they are a, a, a limited edition they've actually got Wiley e. Coyote and Roadrunner on them and so he was chuffed with that and he's, he's toying with the idea of should he really wear them or not so I don't know whether he's just going to save them or actually wear them but I'd wear them where you going so and I had the pleasure of getting the second pair half price and mine were dropped to $40 to begin with and I got another 50% off those so it was like $20 and these I just love the colour. I saw the colour and that was it. So, and I got a little key ring. In the same colour. There we go. So I can, uh, I can wear them now. <laughs> I've been dying to put them on. There we go. What else have we got? Ah, uh, right. Uh, he's taken that. It's his, he, when he went, he was looking for watches and he got, he got quite a few watches. The aviator one is the one that he's taken, that he's got with him. And it's, um, it's like a traditional watch with the face, but then um, it, it, no, it does the steps the calories burned, the distance and the heart rate monitor as well um, and I th that one cost him £150 so it wasn't cheap but but yeah he, he's got that one on by the looks. Um, this one he got from Disney which is very nice and this was £175, this was $175 this one um, and he got it from, he got this one from Disney. Okay. And then, he got this one from Fossil. And that one was, it's still got the, the plastic on the face of this one, so I don't know how good it's going to come out. But this one was actually, that was $99. And then this one was a real bargain. He got it from the Disney Character Warehouse and um, this was $14.99. There we go. And it was the last one there, so that was a bargain. And that was going to be the same price as the other Disney Yeah, ones, yeah, 175 And this was this was actually a Shanghai one. This is uh, so there we go. So that's his watches. Um. Oh yeah. He had to get his Twinkies when he went to Walmart. So. And we got the quest. Uh, the quest. Crest whitening strips, 
think they were about eighteen dollars for twenty. Twenty? Ten or twenty. Twenty strips, yeah. Which is ten treatments. So you get a top and a bottom, so it is it's ten ten treatments. So there we go. Um uh, we got these when we went to the Star Wars land and they're like some sort of, I don't know, bomb or something. So uh, there's the Coca-Cola. Um, it's meant to look like a Star Wars hand grenade. Or something like that, yeah. yeah. That's the Diet Coke. And that's a Sprite. go and also when you went to um, oh, Walmart once again you picked up these uh, they're a cake in a mug and then he's got the cinnamon roll the triple chocolate cake and what's this one? Mm -hmm. Soft baked chocolate chip cookie. And they there's four in each, so you get four lots of it. And they're the Betty Crocker ones. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's him just now coming in. So yeah, they're the Betty Crocker ones, but there's loads of different makes of them. They're just the ones that key and fancy choosing. <sighs> and of course, he did pick up his M&Ms and they were the peanut butter ones. So he's got no chance of anybody stealing these because nobody else likes peanut butter. And he also got the variety pack of brushes. So I don't know what these are like. Um, they're, um, if I remember, they're like a fruity type pad sweets. Oh, right. I think. They're either hard or soft, but they're like fruity sweets, basically. Right. Okay, do So that's those. This is some uh, universal bits. Majority, of, like I say, is, is Kian's stuff really. Now he got the Killer Clowns from Outer Space chocolate bars, and these were one of the houses all Killer Clowns. So he, Ooh, they've got jelly beans in them. <laughs> he's got all sorts in them, but he thought he'd get that actually. Um, we did actually get. Um, a t-shirt each for um, Halloween Horror Nights um, but they're in the wash but yeah we did get one each um, and they're all, all different so there's chocolate frog um, you, know, you can't go to Universal without going to Harry Potter and you can't go to Harry Potter without going and get a chocolate frog. I can't wait to see what kind mm. he's got. <laughs> <laughs> and then you've also got the Bertie Bots Every Flavour Beans and they're another must. Um, okay. Alright yeah we got the pass holder 2019 pass holder pin for the ha ha Halloween. Uh, there we go for the Halloween Horror Nights. Is it gonna? We did go to the malls, like I said, and we did go to obviously 
um, Disney's character warehouse and we picked up we picked up ooh, these there we go now this is a kit purchase he's got is it Hank? yes He's got Hank and the blue one's Destiny, just because I can read yeah. the tags. The white one's called Bailey. I can't remember what's the other one. He's got Hank and another one in, in the car. I'm not sure, but it's another whale, isn't it? Is it? I think it's another whale. He's got Hank and another one in the car anyway, just and he that. needed these to complete his set. So, of course, when he saw them, obviously discounted in. Um, in the Disney warehouse, he had to get them. So there we go. And I think I think they were around seven ninety nine each. I'm not sure. No, he's got um the stingray, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, that's green. What's his name? I don't know. Um, when we went to um. Um, Toy Story Land, he got himself a ball uh, and it's, uh, he's, he's got it to go with the lamp, he's already got the lamp and he was, he's, he's been waiting for, for the ball to come out and this time they had the ball so he picked one up. The Stingray is just called Mr. Ray. Alright. <laughs> All it's called. Um, right. This is stems from last year. Now there was a t-shirt that Kit wanted last year and he couldn't get it in his size. Well he's lost a, a lot of weight for this year. In fact I think he's gone down two sizes. Three stone, aren't they? Yeah, the three stone, yeah. Mm. And um, when he saw this, and he, he they had his, his size in it, well, he, he dropped anyway to fit in the size. Um, he, he just had to get it. But it's, it's actually this year's edition, not last year's, because last year was different, and he went all over looking for it and they didn't have it so he had to have this year's edition which is slightly different but it's his pew pew t-shirt there we go there we go that's it that's it and that was 24.99 Alright, there's another is it pen. No, it's the magnet from Halloween Horror Nights. We're finding little baggies in everywhere. So everything's all mixed up. Yeah. So this basically looks like the pin. Oh. But it's just a magnet version instead. There we go. Always oh, gotta get a magnet. And we're down to our last bag now, I think. And I don't know whether. Yeah, there it is. Now I think we said about this, this was the universal refillable mug. Now, this one is for the parks, not the resort, the parks. Um, I think it was around 15 to 20 dollars but um, that gives you refillable for the, for the rest of the day and then the following day or whenever um, you can reactivate it I think it's for something like seven dollars a day or something and you get as many refills as you like. So um, each day you just 
reactivate it and you get your free drinks as such. So um, I know as well that you don't have to um, buy one every time you go, you can take this back year after year <coughs> and um, just reactivate it. But we like to have the, um, the different styles each year. So we picked one up last year for the ha Halloween Horror Nights and this is this year's Halloween Horror Nights. But we're going back in November, um, well, October, I didn't know, November. November the 10th. And uh, so we'll be taking this one with us and reactivating it. We might have a Christmas one out then. Yeah, we may, yeah, 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 depending on what they've got, we may, may pick up a, a new one anyway. Mm. So there we go. That is all of our um, haul and hoping we, we've got everything. Um, sorry about the loss of um, the haul data or what have you. I don't know, I'm not up on these things. Um, footage? Yes, footage. We lost, you know, lost footage. Um, but hopefully we don't have any more problems and um, we'll get on now sorting out the um, editing. Yeah, Beth and all the editing. <laughs> the uh, oh, the vlogs. Oh yeah, the vlogs. So the vlogs will be coming soon. I know some of you can't wait. <laughs> I can't. I can't edit. I'm. I'm useless at editing. It's gonna be a long, long. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm useless at editing. That's Beth's job. <laughs> I just take all the footage. That's why that's not very good, and it gives her hard work then. But then we have November's coming. I don't think I'll be finishing editing all of this by the November trip. Oh yeah. Well, so November. But once this once come. this is finished, yeah. then uh, you'll get the November footage. Yeah, but once we finish November, uh, uh, we haven't announced. We haven't announced next year's. So keep a lookout for a new. Update video. Well, now for a new announcement, we've got an announcement to come. Um, I don't know when we're gonna do it. We do it. We can do it now if you want. We can do it now. Um, it's Bethan's twenty-first in January. Woo. Um, <laughs> so we decided that all the girlies would get together and go away on holiday for celebrating Bethan's 21st. So we're going away for 10 days and we'll be going to Disney and staying at Coronado Springs. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, Coronado yes. Springs for 10 nights next May. Woo! So by the time I finish editing all of November's, you'll have May's. <laughs> May's will be coming out. Yeah. <laughs> so there we go. So that's something else to look forward to. So it's just going to be hectic. Probably. Yeah, a hectic bit, bit of editing for yourself. Yeah. And hopefully we should have plenty of footage for you guys. So anyway, until then, we shall see you again. And it's... Bye for now.